Hello everyone, we are here at Arcade City at Branson Landing, Missouri. We were here the second week of May 2022. I am just going to do an arcade walkthrough. So when you first go in, this far wall is full of claw machines and they always have great claw machine prizes. Um, but these are the Elot uh, claw machines meaning they have a payout schedule. You have to spend so much money before you actually win. Not my favorite type of claw machine. There is the DC comic superhero coin for sure. Some ticket claw machines, SpongeBob, Whack-A-Mole, um, the sports, the basketball, the skee-ball, the bowling. Here is a Plinko. I've not played this one yet. This is a newer game. It, it's huge. I prefer the old classic Plinko where you actually put the tokens in, but that does look pretty impressive. And my husband's favorite, um, Tailgate Toss. Let's bounce some more ski ball. Down the Clown. My husband likes Down the Clown too. They've got two stations of Wizard of Oz coin pusher. That's my favorite game here to play at this arcade. So the, the, um, Prices to play the games are pretty average compared to every other arcade, so it's a fair deal. Here was, oh, a Minions Whack-A-Mole. And these two claw machines are um, smaller squishies. They're cute. I don't, I think these claw machines are new here. And then we have a claw machine where you have to look down. These are plastic balls in here. Usually it's full of better plush, so... And then we have a candy claw. This is one of those play till you win um, some cheap candy. <laughs> and not very impressive, but if you like candy, you're going to get some guaranteed. And this far wall, they used to have a drink station. Now they have Crossy Road, Flappy Bird, and a duck claw machine. Another one of those play till you win. They still have free soda here. It is now behind the prize counter. So if you want a soda, you just have to ask the employee. Um, some more ticket claw machines. They have a lot of ticket claw machines at this arcade. And let's see, there's the Wizard of Oz again. They have moved stuff around. This is definitely slightly different from when we were here last um, winter. This is one of those rolling ball games that you don't want to push it too far so it lands in your, the perfect ticket spot. This is a remake of a classic carnival game. And what was Robert wanting to show me? Oh, he wanted to show me these ticket claws. It's the one where you drop it onto the conveyor belt and hopefully it'll push more forward. Um, we like those types of claw machines. And Power Roll, that's what that old game is called. It's hard, <laughs> it's hard. If you remember the old classic Carnival one, it was a huge um, metal uh, wavy line and then like a bowling ball. Oh, it was so hard. <laughs> And then Big Bass Will, Baseball Pro, Piano Keys. This far wall right here, it used to be an open space and they had virtual reality games and I think they had, um, I think it was just a virtual reality room. I do not know why it's blocked off. Um, that is peculiar. Because we actually had tickets to play some of those games for free and now it's no longer there. Um, big Ball uh, Claw Machine classic arcade video. Well, I won't say classic. These are all newer, but you always have the video games. You don't win tickets on those, but you know, kids love the racing games. Not every game is to win tickets here at Arcade City as, as most arcades. Sink It, that's, I like that game. That's my husband. He loves that one too. Classic Tower of Tickets. Um, the newer Monopoly um, Big Will game. And then ice hockey back to the dc marvel um coin pusher i it's my nemesis i'm so bad at that one it's the it's just hard to win now i'm walking back um to look at the prize counter arcade city has a pretty good prize counter compared to other arcades like much better than a chuck e cheese <laughs> um but not my favorite. Um, I mean, there is nice prizes, and I have got some really great, great squishies here before. But I will say in Branson, Bigfoot Arcade has the best prizes. But this one, they got some good ones. You got some plush. You've got some t-shirts. You've got, of course, in the glass counters is the all the cheap candies and um, 
little plastic toys that the kids want. Um, but on the back wall, there's some nice surprises you can build up to. Remember, um, Arcade City is a chain, so you can go to other arcade cities to build up your tickets. The tickets don't expire. Hold them as long as you need to to save for bigger prizes. Like on this wall, they have this big Nerf display, and so those all take lots and lots of tickets. So I have lots of tickets on my card, so I will hoard them um, for a future trip. I've, I've been to an arcade city in Tennessee. I've been to an arcade city in Orlando. So, you know, there's they're all over the place. They're growing, like Dave & Buster's is growing. Round one is growing. It's a good chain. I like it. Um, I'm always happy to see when we go out of town that there's an arcade city. I've been to other locations where they have a Willy Wonka machine. So it was disappointing there's no Willy Wonka here. My husband's fascinated with this claw machine. I'm just like, no. I think it's like $2 to, for that, a chance for that little squishy. It's like, no, no, that's not a good value. I'd rather play Wizard of Oz coin pusher. So thanks for watching and we'll see you later.